There is a string method called at that lets me access individual characters from this particular string. Um, all I have to know to access a character is its index value. So if I number my positions from left to right, I can figure out what I want to pull out here. So say I wanted to get this M and change it or access that better, then I could know that it's an index is two. And so let's see if I can get it out. So let's see how it, oops, that's dot at two. Let's see if we get the M on the screen. Yes, there it is. Um, so at will retrieve from me and access and read um, a, a letter at a particular position. It will also let me change that letter. So let's say I want to change the O in sum to an A. So it's now the word same. I can say S dot at, let's see, the O is at position one equals A. So I'll reassign what letter is at that position. Um, then just to prove that it works, let's see out the S. Okay, so now it says same text. So unlike length, which just retrieves a value and shows it to you and doesn't let you change it, at will retrieve a value for you, and it will also let you change um, the letter that's sitting there. Um, I have to be careful, though, because if I try to access a position that doesn't exist in the string, like let's say I'm trying to go to a position negative one, which doesn't exist, then I have caused a problem, and you'll see what happens when I try to run this is that I get an unhandled exception um, because I've gone out of bounds um, or out of range of the string. So that'll happen if I try to go to a negative location. It'll also happen if I try to go to a position that's outside of the string. So if I try to go to position nine, you're gonna see it causes the same problem. So I have to be very careful that as I'm specifying the index values, I'm staying within the boundaries of the string. So I have to know what my lowest position is, and what my highest position is. Um, and just as an aside, my highest position in my string, if I always want to aim at my last character, is going to be the length minus one. So if I wanted to, I could always say, um, let's change the last letter, whatever. And then when I see it out, let's see. So to get my last letter, I can always use the same number, which isn't a number. In fact, it's just the length minus one. Um, that's just an aside.